is a buckwheat flour you can buy in the United States, any yeah. supermarket. Mm -hmm. I guess you very knowledge that was one of the best ones we've done so far. So Japan is a mill, and then that's where you're using it now. Yeah, so too, too much work. I hope, you know, I hope in the future, I bring the, the system of the store mill yeah. up here. I, I wanna start to making a, a tear everything from the farm. The easier for me, easier. But uh, I try to first explain the people more interesting to the buckwheat is uh, make it open the more high scale. But uh, unfortunately, still people is uh, not understanding real buckwheat. You know, this is a very healthy. A lot of polyphenol lutein. Lutein is a protection for the cancer. Cancer is the blood pressure is a working well. And antioxidant. An antioxidant. You, you understand it? Antioxidant. And the detox. There's a many New York doctors, Cornell, NYU, Columbia. Many doctors is a recommend for the back. Eat for the keep healthy. This is a amazing ingredients. Over ten kind of disease protection before getting back. This one is a, after eat only ten minutes is a through to the blood, and then go to the your pump. Heart is a working well, working well, and then the and then. Uh, start to uh, antioxidant and then a any particle in your body and then eyes is getting more clear and the brain more well but is that this buckwheat is a from uh, 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 like a mongol we, we call the data this is data history You know, you have to know today, this is a data. Uh, in China, not China, like a cross Mongol, Mongolian, Tibet. This is a long, long history, almost 6,000 years ago. They still keep eat back with every day, you know. They around around it's a uh, 80 people, 80 years old, over 100 years old, old, still no disease, and then body is a uh, straight, yeah. not bent, skinny. They can see long way. Skin very beautiful. Yeah, they, they still keep eat like a like a mix like a like a mochi mixed with water. Looks yellow. The taste like a bitter, bitter like a yellow. But Japanese like a, this this type of the but with a different type. But category same. In in world in the world, two hundred variety. Of back with 200 seeds. You know, like this. This long history. I believe, I believe this seed come from the space. <laughs> space. Yeah. Because uh, many history is coming like this. Now writing down for the back with. But anyway. So like this. And, and buckwheat, say it's a different type of plant than you know corn or barley or wheat. It, it's not a, it's not really a cereal. It's a, it's its own thing, right? It's a different part of the family, right? Yeah. Very. So I'm sorry. So next process eating. So so under you. So you have a time. If if over time, so you can cut order. But I I try to explain. Uh, yeah, until, until you have a time. There's more times people want to stay on board, so we can see the wall. 
process. If folks need to leave early, that's, that's totally fine. And if okay. you do need to leave early, we'll have a recording for this posted. Okay. So if you're recording, just let us know. Okay. Thank you. How many minutes left? 15, but if you need to finish in overtime, that's fine. Okay. So please, today, you have to learn. You have to learn is a back wind is what? You can go to uh, Wikipedia. So this is a natural medicine. But we can cook uh, more delicious by your, with your skill, cooking skill. You know, buckwheat has a many potential that uh, makes more healthy for the everybody. Two dough, making one dough. I take a picture. <laughs> Good. 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 Enjoy, right? Enjoy. <laughs> okay, this is a kneading process. Kneading. So flour is very high moisture, high nutrients. Easy to make it the dough. You add salt in all the process or do you just buckwheat and salt and water? Just buckwheat and the water. No salt, no wheat. 100% gluten free. Gluten free. So, you know, if you're, if you're going to the store and buy like the, the like dried this. buckwheat, is that made in the same process or are there things added to it? So I think a local store they don't sell much they don't sell much for the uh, gluten free and then also you can buy for the pre-made pre-made buckwheat pre-made buckwheat noodle but that is a uh, Already, you can see ingredient side. You can see uh, already using a, a lot of wheat flour, sixty percent. So, but I saw the couple of the products, one hundred percent buffet. But uh, I think the taste is uh, not fresh. So I think uh, they are uh, mixed with something. I think so. So I I I already this is buckwheat flour too. I think fine one. Buckwheat fine gonna be like a uh, white. More white. This is buckwheat. I using uh, this sieve too. Using uh, this buckwheat flour too. Little. Is it possible to tilt the camera down a little bit so we can see what you're doing a little bit better? Oh, this one? Oh, yeah. yeah. Of course, of course. So today is uh, I'm making for the my home. This is my home living room. So is a uh, temperature is not not well. It be getting hot. Okay, condition is uh, not well, but I try to making better. I'm using a rolling pin. So, like this. Like this. But uh, already start to break. Start to break. 
break. Needle is uh, getting dry because usually I have to finish it for the straight in 20 minutes and then cut. I have to keep it in the, the temperature in cooler, not cool, but I have to be a uh, deep wooden box. I show you then. So this is a little bit so it is goro. So 
I want to is more making bigger, more making bigger, but uh, that takes a long time and then soba is getting dry. I try to finish in cut. Usually more getting bigger, okay? But uh, today is a little bit difficult to, in the time, you know. So I try to finish now. Maybe I can try to show you very fast to get in dry. Like a paper, like a paper, very, you know, very delicate, very delicate. You know, this is a holding, you know, this is a holding. And then finally cut, finally cut. This is a brush, it's a, a horse, horse tape brush. It's a very good for the, you know, for the flower. It's a horse, come from horse. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Then finally, the big, what is it? Big cutting board. Like this. Then I'm making cushion for the door. I image the size. I put the cushion for like this. Okay. And then finally, this is cutting guide board. The small material is very unique. The design. Moving here and then just cut. That board is used to spread the flower easily, or is that what you use to cut off? Yes, yes, exactly. Okay, just, okay, okay. just cut. Oh, yeah. In cooler. 
in the fridge. Yeah, big fridge. You can keep a plastic container too. You can do. But this is a material is a design is a 400 years ago. Same same design. I use it. I like it. Okay. Yes, that's it. And if no white flower like this, this is buckwheat. No, like a texture, like a starch, corn starch and the potato starch, very similar. Because between, you know, have to put to the flower, otherwise stick, sticky, sticky together. Okay, so keep doing. Uh, in Japan, typically, how is soba served? Soba serve is uh, zaru soba, mori soba, just boil 30 minutes. Yeah, 30 seconds. 30 seconds. So, uh, this noodle is a boiling time is 30 seconds. Portion 30 order one time, but uh, today is only one kilo, only 12 order, 13 order. But if grow here, small portion with uh, soba salad, something maybe you can make one time one kilo, you can create for maybe 40 order, 50 order. Only only small portion, pretty, eh? pretty soba salad. You don't need to a uh, big, big portion, right. Fancy restaurant have to be a small portion. Cheap restaurant have to be a big one, right? In, in Japan, is, is soba a casual thing, or is it more of like a special dish in milk? Yeah, good question. And so, uh, soba has a cheap restaurant, middle restaurant, high end soba restaurant. Have three type uh, restaurant. High end is a, of course, is a has a Michelin level very high end the soba is a uh, 100% soba in the handmade and uh, good one but the middle one is a between with uh, enjoy sake sake place the middle like izakaya style but the cheap one street food but street food soba restaurant is uh, just one point Japanese only soba like this much portion you can eat only two dara between three dara. Standing soba noodle restaurant. Standing. But is there a difference between how it's made between the Different. very high end and the street food? And the street food is a, like a more dry flour. The more faster to grind, it's more cost. It's a food cost is a cheap. But the stone mill grind. Is a big cost too, and then quality is well, but the uh, price is uh, cost expensive. And then, so street food, street food soba, and uh, mixed with a fifty percent wheat flour. So that is a uh, operation easy, strong noodle, easy for each employee, each store franchise. That is a uh, most of fifty percent. 60% mixed with wheat. The cost is more cheap and cheap. Street food we can uh, make in for the profit also too. But the high end is uh, very expensive because flour is uh, getting food from directly farmers. The farmer is uh, making very good quality. They, they keep uh, moisture 
until grind, stone grind, and then after grind, immediately making noodles like this. The very high, high labor, and then also uh, location very well, and then maybe I was working with a Michelin One Star Soba restaurant in Japan. The code is a Hosokawa. Hosokawa is a Ryogoku, uh, Ryogoku, uh, Japan. And there is a uh, one customer is a uh, pay for for it is a uh, uh, soba uh, course menu. Maybe it uh, takes about one hundred dollar plus a drink. And then no tip. Maybe average is a uh, dinner time is a uh, soba restaurant pay for the one customer is a uh, average two hundred dollar soba restaurant one person. Very similar like a Blue Hill. Blue Hill more high high level, but uh, soba restaurant is a uh, you good question. So confusing. Soba restaurant street food soba. How different with the real soba? This is expensive. You know, street food is a um, cheap, only two dollar street food. So depending your idea, your skill, which soba is uh, want to make a real soba. Real soba, you have to more practice. But the cheap soba, you can use a noodle big machine, noodle machine for the making increased production. So yeah, I mean, that, that really sums up perfectly everything we've been talking about this week. You know, it's mm -hmm. good to using all the same grains, but when it comes down to how you're getting grains from the farm to the kitchen, mm -hmm. that's where the real craft is, and that's where the biggest difference is. So if if you want to and learn more about soba. So I, I can I can next time so more different type. And today I don't have a time making for the sauce soup.